Welcome one and all to America's Army Proving Grounds. Apparently you have to enter in a code every time you want to log in. Thank you. Access granted. Fantastic. Alright, let's move on. So, this is the propaganda game to get you to join the U.S. military. I, I, I guess. I, I don't know. It's, it's, it's interesting. Anyway, you have your soldiers, riflemen, automatic riflemen, designated marksmen, and sniper. Now, I wish I could zoom in because look, look at that guy's face. It's, it's fucking it's ter oh oh he ducked it's fucking terrible like the graphics are just outdated as hell and yes this is a free to play game i understand that but it's fucking brutal like and i i mean you can't really go wrong oh yeah dead eye fuck yeah for sure reloading i got your back man oh you can change your shit your weapons, you got a bunch of stuff. Saw, the M14 EBR, M24, your Beretta. Oh, I guess they actually have, oh. Maybe they, do they? Yeah, they do, okay. Omega Arsenal. I don't know if that's actually what they use. I thought they were Colts, but I could be wrong. Enemy weapons, AK-105, AK-107. Supernova. That's not a shotgun. <laughs> That's not a fucking RPK. And here we are. The Dragonov. The SV-98. Everybody knows this one from Battlefield. And the CZ-2 pistol. Alright, so we're going to play a game. Actually, first, I want to... Turn down the fucking audio. My god, that's loud as hell. Okay. So, we're gonna play a game. Now, this game, I'm, it, I've am i played a few rounds of it. It's it's t absolutely terrible. Fucking terrible. <clears throat> no, basic training. I, this your little video. Action camera. Alright, so here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna go load out. Normally, I'm the automatic rifleman, but I'm just gonna be a rifleman. Uh, that works. So we have to defend and go wherever. Now, th this game, it looks terrible. Like, it's, it's playable, but it looks bad. Like, it, it's not a well-put-together game. It's not fun, and I don't understand the premise behind it. Like, I played the original America's Army for the Xbox when I was a kid. My parents actually went out and bought it for me because it was a military game, and I've always been interested in the military, right? And, and of course, it's not Canadian, but whatever. You know, we'll roll with it. It's not fucking too terrible. And it was actually a really good game. It was quite realistic. Like, it was single player, and I believe it had an Xbox Live mode, but I didn't have Xbox Live at the time. But it's just... This is just not a very well put together game. Like, I... That's me stopping to sprint. I mean, you're looking down your scope. Th that's what it looks like. Like, here's some of the graphics. Ooh, shitty wood grain. Ooh, shitty crack metal. Ooh, Tyvex. Ooh. There, grenade up there. Let's see what happens. All right, got one. Holy fuck, it's amazing. <clears throat> There's two. Beautiful. Like, it... I mean... If you're looking for something to just do, I mean, I guess it's fun. But in all reality, it's not really that great. Oh, look at you! Super Asian. He looks like he has Down Syndrome. Is this is this the kind of troops you have, America? Do you just have a bunch of people with Down Syndrome? Okay, stop sprinting. I don't know if... I don't think that was our guy.
See if we can go single shot. Whoa, whoa, ow! You hurt me! It's bandage, okay, now, now I'm apparently good. Got him. Bandage again, because I'm not doing too hot. Go back to auto. Well, that was a great fucking grenade. Apparently this asshole can't throw her shit. Oh, shotgun. <clears throat> that's just like that's that's the game, man. Like it's doesn't look good. It makes no sense to me as a military propaganda game. Like, none of it makes sense. This game does not make me feel like I want to join the military. The original America's Army was pretty fucking cool. It had all sorts of different shit to do. Sniper route. There you go. You're being told where to go, snipers. That's what's up. See, I lasted super long, that one. That guy got fucking sniped off. This guy gonna kill himself? Oh my god, yeah, he got himself and that guy. <laughs> True American, take himself down for the, the better of the people, fuck's sake. <laughs> oh man. <clears throat> like, that's how you revive people. That's fucking amazing. I can no longer be revived. Well, thank you. Like, it was just so t terribly designed. Come on, you got him. Go get him. Win us this round. <clears throat> like, the level design is odd. Like, I don't understand. Okay, so we won the match. So that's the premise of this game. This is going to be a short and sweet video anyway. That's the premise of this game. That's what I don't understand about this. It makes no fucking sense as a realistic shooter of any sort. And it's just... It's just fucking weird. I mean, it is free to play. So, if you're lacking in money and you're looking for a first-person shooter that works, I mean, America's Army is great. But for any other sort of thing, like, it doesn't tell you how things are done. It, it, like, and it, it makes you think that things are ten times better than they actually are. It's just... It's just a bad game. All in all, it's just a, a terrible, terrible game. Anyway, thank you very much for watching, guys. I hope you enjoyed. It was going to be a short video today. I'm going to be putting up more like this. I want to try downloading a bunch of these free-to-play games and kind of pick and choose which one's actually half-decent. I, I think that's something I want to start doing. So, America's Army, I'm going to give it 4 out of 10. A 4 because it's at least playable. It's not great. The graphics are terrible. The gameplay is odd. None of it makes any sense. <clears throat> The gunplay is absolutely horrific, but it works as a first-person shooter, and I can see being bored, 
lack of money, whatever else, free to play game, it's fun. Anyway, thank you very much for watching yet again, and I will see you guys in the next one.